not every cop is fucked up, but when I hear something fucked up happen to a cop, I be like, eh, he probably had it fucking coming. Because okay. the motherfuckers like you. In Arizona, that black driver got pulled over after allegedly making a turn without a proper signal. The cops approached with their guns drawn. Good cops get fucked up raps because of people like you. You came to the car with your gun out. For what? Do you have no conscience of, you don't see what the fuck going on on TV? You, but you don't give a fuck, right? Cause I just would have been another dead black motherfucker, right? And you just would have went about your business, right? 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 That, let's keep it real, let's keep it 100. I have no issue if you could just, just be honest, right? You just would have been like, oh, a mistake happened. Right? You'd have been there to just wake up the next day, not lose a drop of motherfucking sleep. But I'd have had three fucking kids. Three kids with no dad. Dad a criminal? Nope. Dad a thug? Nope. Dad shot dead by a cop, made a mistake. Cause you wanna come with your gun drawn. The officer is speechless. You got kids in the wife? Don't you wanna make it to your fucking kids and wife? You picked a dangerous fucking job, and I respect that. I respect your job, but my G, drawing a fucking gun? That's why I lose the respect. The respect is out of the fucking window. You drew a fucking gun on me for a fucking turn signal. There's nothing illegal in this car, about the car, about me, but I got a gun drawn on me. Shit is fucked up, man. I need to think about that. Yeah, I understand it's dangerous and all that. But that come with your job. The anger and bewilderment is understandable. Hello, everybody. I'm David Schuster, and thanks for joining us. According to local Arizona reports, that black motorist and the cop waited for a police supervisor. The officers then issued a citation, and the father of three was allowed to leave. As the man said, this could have been a lot worse. Imagine if the police, with their guns drawn initially, misunderstood the guy reaching for his driver's license. And why did the police have their guns pointing at him to begin with? The vehicle was not stolen, as a license plate check confirmed, and the man did not lead the cops on a chase. One can only conclude that the arresting officer engaged in racial profiling and approached with a gun drawn initially because the driver was black. White police in Arizona have a terrible reputation when it comes to their handling of black men, and this case confirms it. Failure to signal? Come on. This time, however, the officer got a black man who, despite his fears, was not going to stay quiet. The tongue lashing and shame heaped on the officer is likely something that cop and many other people who see this video will never forget. And nor should they. Police across the United States treat innocent black people unfairly every day. And we see videos of police becoming violent every week. This police culture of racial profiling and suspicion has to change. The stakes are too high, and the stain on America hurts all of us.